Hello everyone and welcome. Uh, this is a presentation of my solo project that had as the main purpose a practical approach to React and Redux. I'm a book lover and this project idea came as a necessity to have a space where a person can uh, search for a book, uh, can keep track of the books he is currently reading or he already read, um, save some thoughts, give it a rating and so on. So this is my landing page and I'm starting with the quote of the day. I'm using an API that will generate a quote every time you're going to be on the, on the page. Um, so if I'm refreshing, the code is supposed to change. Here we go. And then we have our search bar and I'm using Google API, which I think it's a awesome source where you can look for any book you want. And I'm going to search for a book. Currently I'm reading this book right here. Let's see if they have it. So you will get a results of a few books with the same title that you're searching for. And here you have the opportunity to see a few details about the book, a small description, the average rating, language, when it was published and so on. And um, after you're done searching, if there is a book that you're interested in, you're able to add it to your collection, to the books that you want to read. So since I'm reading this right here, let me see a few details here. And I'm going to add it to my collection. Then you have the opportunity to go to this link right here. And this will be the list of the books that you added to your collection. Um, I have two right here. And uh, this is where the reading journey begins because you are able to, um, keep, uh, to start keeping records of your books. So you're able here to give it a rating, maybe add a few pages if you did any reading today, um, even choose a category and um, leave a comment. And after you're done, you're just going to hit uh, add and um, you're going to have all the comments or the codes here um, and the last records of the book. Here, let's try once again. I have here. For right now, I'm just going to give it four stars. We'll see when I'm done with the book. Maybe I'm going to change my mind. Uh, I just started to read this book yesterday, so I'm just going to... I think I am at 20 or something. I do that. I'm not going to add a category, but I do want to add a code that I thought it's a nice one. I have it right here. And we're going to add right here. Also, you can change the rating. If you change your mind, you're gonna go here. I'm gonna even add a new comment. Oop. Here we go. We're gonna close that. And after you're done reading the book, you can transfer it to, the, to another page, to the books you already read, uh, where you can delete. If you change your mind, you don't wanna read the book anymore. I'm just going to add that to the books that I already read because I did already. So we'll go here and this will still stay here. And then I'm going to go to my next uh, page right here. And this is a list of the books that I already read. And uh, some of them have the records. So oh, this one doesn't. Let me see. Maybe this one right here. Okay. So I already have a few quotes here. Um, Last time I gave it a rating of five. I did not keep a record of the pages, but I can also add if I'm interested in. Okay, after that, you can close that. And um, as you will see, um, this book right here that we just added, it's still gonna have um, the comments, the rating. So even if you transfer the book from one page to another, you'll still be able to see your records. It does not get deleted. And uh, here you're also able to delete a book for some reason. I don't know. We'll delete that. And it's gone. I'm looking, I'm uh, using local storage. So it doesn't matter if you're going to refresh the page. If you're going to come tomorrow, you're still going to be able to see um, the books and the records. This does not have any records. Maybe this one right here. Here we go. If uh, this will be your first time on the page, um, then you're probably not going to have anything in your collection. So you're going to get a message that says that there's 
nothing to display here yet or even on this page or probably ask you to start reading because it's not a bad habit to have and um, yeah like i said for this project i used uh, react redux uh, javascript css uh, local storage react bootstrap it was um, a project that i really enjoyed working on and i hope you enjoyed this video as well thank you